5 Precautions and 6 Simple Steps to Apply Toothpaste on Pimples If you're struggling with a breakout, you might feel embarrassed or frustrated. Whether you've tried other pimple remedies without success or you're looking for a quick solution you can try at home, applying toothpaste to your pimple can help it heal faster. In this video, we're going to reveal 6 simple steps to apply toothpaste on your pimples. But before you learn how to apply toothpaste on your pimples, we need to make sure you take proper precautions, so make sure you take the following five precautions. Precaution number one, choosing the right toothpaste. When choosing a toothpaste for acne treatment, go for an all-white version, not a toothpaste with red, blue, or green stripes. This is because the ingredients which help to dry out pimples, such as baking soda, hydrogen peroxide, and triclosan, are contained in the white part of the toothpaste while the colored sections may contain ingredients which will irritate the skin. Precaution number two, avoid teeth whitening toothpaste. Whitening toothpastes contain bleaching agents for making teeth whiter, which may actually bleach or burn the skin, causing patchiness. This is particularly true for people with darker skin tones, as the extra melanin in the skin makes it more reactive and therefore more prone to marks and blemishes. People with fair skin may be less affected by such ingredients. However, it is better to avoid whitening toothpaste regardless. Precaution number three, steer clear of gel toothpastes. Gel type toothpastes have a different formulation than actual paste toothpastes and so may be lacking the active ingredients necessary to effectively dry out pimples. Avoid using as it will not do your skin any good. Precaution number four, Choose a toothpaste with a lower fluoride content. Fluoride is added to over 95% of toothpastes in the U.S. as it helps to remove dental plaque and prevent gum disease. However, many people actually suffer from a mild topical allergy to fluoride, and it may cause dermatitis, a skin rash, if it comes in contact with the skin. For this reason, it is best to find a toothpaste with as low a fluoride content as possible, or fluoride-free if you can find it, to minimize the risk of skin irritation. Precaution number five, go organic. Organic toothpastes are probably your best option when it comes to treating pimples. They contain no fluoride, unless it's naturally derived, and no nasty growth hormones, pesticides, or other chemicals. On the other hand, they still contain the ingredients necessary for drying out pimples, such as baking soda and tea tree oil. With the addition of natural soothing and antibacterial substances like aloe, myrrh, and eucalyptus oil. So those are the five precautions you need to take before you apply toothpaste on your pimples. Now let's look at the six steps to applying toothpaste on your pimple for maximum effect. Step one, wash your face. As with any spot treatment, it is important to apply the toothpaste to clean, dry skin. This ensures that there is no dirt or excess oil on the skin that may limit the effectiveness of the treatment. Wash your face well with warm water and your favorite cleanser, then pat dry to lock in moisture. Step 2. Squeeze a little toothpaste onto your finger. Squeeze a little toothpaste onto your index finger or the back of your hand. A pea-sized amount should be enough, depending on the number of pimples you're treating. Step 3. Apply a small amount of toothpaste directly onto the pimple. You will only need to apply a very small amount of toothpaste to the pimple for the treatment to be effective. Just make sure that you apply the toothpaste directly onto the pimple itself, not on the surrounding skin. Toothpaste should never be spread all over the skin or used as a face mask. This is because the toothpaste works by drying out the skin, which can cause redness, irritation, and peeling if applied anywhere but the pimple itself. Step 4. Leave the toothpaste on for two hours or overnight. Leave the toothpaste to dry on the skin anywhere from two hours or overnight for best results. However, if you have extremely sensitive skin, it may be best to remove the toothpaste after 15 minutes to half an hour in order to gauge your skin's reaction. If it seems to be handling the toothpaste okay, you can leave it on for increasingly longer periods. Some people advocate placing a Band-Aid over the pimple to help the toothpaste stay in place. However, this is not advisable, as it may cause the toothpaste to spread on the surrounding skin, leading to irritation while also preventing the skin from breathing. Step 5. Gently wash off. You can wash off the toothpaste with a damp washcloth using small circular motions. 
Make sure to do this very gently, as rubbing too hard might irritate or damage the skin. When all the toothpaste has been removed, splash your face with some warm water and pat dry with your hands or a clean, soft towel. You may want to apply a soothing moisturizer if your skin feels very tight and dry. Step 6. Repeat no more than four times a week. As mentioned before, toothpaste may be irritating, especially if you have sensitive skin. So this is not a treatment you should be using multiple times a day or more than four times a week. After applying the treatment once a day, two to three days in a row, you may notice an improvement in the size and color of the pimple. From that point on, you should allow the pimple to heal on its own. So, those are six steps to applying toothpaste on your pimples to get the maximum benefit out of it. Have you tried this home remedy and what were your results? Let us know in the comments below. If you found this video useful, make sure to hit that like button and share it with someone who might find this useful. And lastly, to get more videos like this, make sure to subscribe to Your Health TV. Thanks for watching and see you again in another video.